Boom! We're live. I'm Chris Igo, Igo Home Group, powered by Remax Direct. It is uh, Monday morning. We are doing big things. We are getting shit done. And uh, there are 19 leads to call, uh, which is a culmination of expireds, canceled, fizzbos. Um, so we're going to call them right now. Uh, it is 744. And let's do the damn thing. <clears throat> All right, two are going to be filtered out. They're not in my price points. That's okay. We wish them all the best anyway. Uh, 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 uh. Richie Rich, what's up, man? I don't know what the calendar looks like. That's what the calendar looks like. Ah, shit. <laughs> oh, I'm falling apart here. Hit the start button. <laughs> We're trying to reach. Is not available to take your call. Please leave a message after the tone. Yeah, Press the pound key to end recording. Hello, this is Chris Igo with Remax. I'm giving you a call. I noticed your property listing was canceled in the MLS. I was curious how on earth the property did not sell. We specialize in selling properties just like yours in Atlantic Grove. We've sold 15,000 homes since 2008. We're averaging one a day. We've got active shoppers looking for properties similar to yours in Delray Beach. I would love an opportunity to bend your ear in relation to actually getting it sold. If you would, please give me a call back. My number is 561-516-2442. Again, 561-516-2442. Thank you. Uh, what's up, Ray? Uh, normally, I would have just dropped a uh, voicemail on him, but uh, I got a little bit flustered since I... Don't seem to be coordinated enough to manage to handle. Hello, this is Chris Igo with Remax. I'm giving you a call. I noticed your property listing had expired in the MLS. I was curious, how on earth did the property not sell? Oh, I'm not, I'm not interested. Oh, I didn't say anything interesting yet. Put your guns back in your holster. I was curious, while you were on the market, did you have any offers on the property? I apologize. Yeah, no, I was I was very curious. We we sell a lot of property in uh, in Four Seasons of Del Rey, so I was just curious. Did you have yeah, any I'm offers? Yeah, I'm not. I'm not. No, I'm not. I don't. I don't know what you're talking about. I'm not interested. This is not regarding to me. This is not my property. I'm oh my! It's, okay, it's the wrong number. I apologize. Okay, I'll take you off the list. Hey, by the way, do you know anybody thinking about buying or selling real estate that I might be able to help? <laughs> she hung up. And it was three times in a row. That's what happens when you hang up on me without having a conversation. I just continue to call you back relentlessly like a hammer. <clears throat> a phone hammer. All right, so that's three contacts. <laughs> All right. Forwarded to an automatic voice message system. Five, six, right. one, right. two, six, six, three, six. Hello, this is Chris Igo with Remax. I'm giving you a call. I noticed your property listing was canceled in the MLS. I was curious, how on earth did the property not sell? Oscar? 
Oscar. Let's call him back. Hello, it, it's... Well, that was the wrong number, but I'll drop a message on him anyway. Just have the common decency to say it's the wrong number so I can remove your name from the list. Don't just hang up on me. It's rude. That's rude. Don't be rude. Change your attitude. <laughs> Uh, let's go. Forwarded to an automated voice messaging system. Um, well, Rich, that's a good question. Um, since my tracking has been uh, remiss, uh, I don't have a scientific answer for you, but uh, I can tell you just off the top of my head, uh, in the last quarter, this is a correct statement, in the last quarter, I've had two, maybe three callbacks. Dr. Christopher K. That uh, not have called back. I've ended up listing their property, and of those three, uh, two have sold. So leave messages. You never know. I find that when I actually leave them, they're more likely. In fact, they've all but all of the callbacks I've had have been off of uh, authentic voicemails. Not true. Not exactly true. I can think of one where it was a, uh, a recorded drop. But whatever. I mean, uh, if you don't ask for them to call you back, the odds are 100% that they're not going to call you back. So if you leave a message, ask them to call you back, then um, the odds are higher that they will. But now that my tracking is totally dialed in and on point, I'll have a scientific answer for you. Uh -huh. Hello, this is Chris Igo with Remax. I'm giving you a call. I noticed your property listing had expired in the MLS. I was curious, how on earth did the property not sell? Um, I'm no longer owner. Oh. Do you have property in Florida? Yeah, yeah. You're not for whatever reason your number is associated with that uh, expired listing. I'll I'll take you off the list so you don't get any more phone calls from us. Um, so I got a question in closing. Do you happen to know anybody out there thinking about buying or selling real estate? I might be able to help. Um, yeah, no, I know. Uh, I don't. I have moved uh, to New Jersey. So mm -hmm. I, I, I'm sorry. I can't help you with that. Well, I appreciate you uh, considering it. I'm actually from New Jersey, too. So uh, <laughs> you, you made the uh, reverse, oh, okay. reverse move. M most people are coming down here to escape the winter and whatnot. But oh, yeah, yeah. By my choice. <laughs> oh, I, I hear you. All right. Well, hey, listen. Have yeah. a have a great day. Okay. Yeah, I'll be back. I'll be back in a few years. Well, so, let me ask you, you this. Course, but, you know, when I'm ready to look. <laughs> Would it offend you if I texted you my contact information so that you have it, and then this way, whenever you uh, are ready to look, you know where to find me. Sounds great. You are in uh, Palm Beach. I sure am. Okay. Super. Sounds good. And, and what's your best email address? I won't spam you, but I will I will email you my contact information. No, that's okay. Um, my, uh, your phone is fine. Okay. You know, I actually have it in my phone. Super. All right. Have a great day. I appreciate it. What's your name? Shelly. Shelly. All right, Shelly. Well, you have a fantastic day, and I look forward to uh, catching up with you soon. All right? Okay, thanks. You're welcome. Bye. Bye. Oh, Shelly. Yeah, Fizzbo's called back. 
Absolutely. Hello, this is Chris Igo with Remax. I'm giving you a call. I noticed your property listing had expired in the MLS. I was curious, how on earth did the property not sell? Hello, this is Chris Igo with Remax. I'm giving you a call. I noticed your property listing had expired in the MLS. I was curious, how on earth did the property not sell? All right. Mm -hmm. I'll have to do a welfare check on that gentleman or lady. All right back. Reach the offices of Corporate Air Search International. If you know your. Mm -hmm. I'm going to go ahead and call that a bad number. Hello, this is Chris Igo with. Thank you for calling Tampa Obstetrics Answering Service. If this is a medical emergency, if this is a medical emergency, uh, it is not. <clears throat> it's a real estate emergency. Hello. Hey, this is Chris Igo with Remax. I'm giving you a call. I noticed your property listing had expired in the MLS. I was curious. How on earth did the property not sell? Well, that's really interesting because I don't own property, so I hmm. don't know where you're seeing that. Well, that's called the wrong number. <laughs> so I'll take you off the list so you don't get any more phone calls from us. Let me let me ask you this. Do you happen to know anybody out there thinking about buying or selling real estate that I might be able to help? Be honest. Uh, no. All right. Would it offend you if I texted you my contact information so that you have it? And this way, if you ever have any real estate needs, you know where to find me. I'm, I'm, I'm not interested. I'm a realtor myself. So. All right. Well, I, I wish you the best. All right, my man? Thank you. Thank You're welcome. Now, if my systems and processes were a little bit more dialed in, I would have said something along the lines of, how's business? Would you like to come in for a complimentary consultation on um, supercharging your business so you can 10X your business here with the I Go Home Group? Um, but I'm not quite there yet. Soon, soon, soon we scale. All right, uh, let's see here. What am I doing? All right, so that was a wrong number. Sir, are you aware there are 40,000 realtors in Palm Beach County, and of them, only 1,000 sell 10 or more properties a year? A year, sir. Are you one of those? 
Are you one of those 39,000? Because if you are, I go home for you. All right. Where I guarantee you will sell at least 10 homes or more a year. Hello, this is Chris. Hey, it's Chris Igo with Remax. I'm giving you a call. I noticed your property listing had expired in the MLS and was curious how on earth did the property not sell? Sir? <clears throat> What's up, Josh Bryan? Person you are trying to reach has a voicemail box that has not been set up yet. Please try. Have you been banned from send out cards yet? It's the cool thing to do. No, oh, there he is, the call hammer, the inside sales assassin, Jeremy Marquez. I call you close. Been forwarded to an automatic voice message. System. Nine, five, four, six, two, six, zero, four. Drop a message on that ass. All right. Big day today, Jeremy. Big day. Hello, this is Chris I Hey, it's Chris Igo with Remax. I'm giving you a call. I noticed your property listing had expired in the MLS. I was curious, how on earth did the property not sell? Wow, let's just call you right back. It's rude. Rude. Oh. To connect to Dr. Gady Abramson, located on North Park Road. Nah, wrong number. the wrong number. Please Hello. leave your message uh, for 561358242. Hello, this is Chris Igo with Remax. I'm giving you a call. I noticed your property listing had expired in the MLS. I was curious how on earth the property did not sell. I actually sold your neighbor's home on Lakeview and I'm about to uh, list your other neighbor uh, on Lakeview <clears throat> uh, in the next week. Um, now, just so you know, we've sold 15,000 homes since 2008. We're averaging one a day. I would love an opportunity to bend your ear in relation to actually getting your property sold. If you would, please give me a call back. My number is 561-516-2442. Again, 561-516-2442. Thank you. Uh, and you were on the market for 365 days, so chances are you're a little bit overpriced. Big Murph, happy birthday. What's going on? I've got to get the Nuggets tablet back to her. It is in. Been forwarded to an automatic voice message system. Nine five four eight one six six zero two three is not available. At the tone, please record your message. When you have finished recording, you may hang up or press one for more options.
Hello, this is Chris Igo with Remax. I'm giving you a call. I noticed your property listing had expired in the MLS. I was curious how on earth the property did not sell. We specialize in selling properties just like yours in Parkland Golf and Country Club. We've sold 15,000 homes since 2008. We're averaging one a day. I would love an opportunity to bend your ear in relation to actually getting it sold. If you would, please give me a call back. My number is 561-516-2442. Again, 561-516-2442. Thank you. <clears throat> and while I'm listing your home, I can go pop in over at the governor's house and say, what's up? Because <clears throat> I got friends and family in Parkland. Hello, this is Chris Igo. Hey, it's Chris Igo with Remax. I'm giving you a call. I noticed your property listing had expired in the MLS. I was curious, how on earth did the property not sell? I have at least out the Oh, that's awesome. Okay, well, that's a good thing. Now, whoa, we're not done talking, lady. We got at least. I've got investors that would love to purchase your home while it's leased. Try to sass me with the hang up. What's up, Mike? Hello. Leave your name and number, and I will call you back as soon as I can. Hey, it's Chris Igo with Remax. You just hung up on me. I, I did want to at least let you know that we have investors that are very interested in purchasing properties that have uh, tenants in it uh, in place. Um, so if that's something that you're interested in, let me know. Um, I do business completely different than anybody else out there, and it virtually guarantees you two things. One, your property will sell. Two, you'll end up with significantly more money bottom line than you could get any other way. If that's something you're interested in learning more about, please give me a call. My number is 561-516-2442. Again, 561-516-2442. Thank you. <clears throat> hey, buddy, it's Chris Igo with Remax. I'm giving you a call. I noticed your property listing had expired in the MLS. I was curious how on earth the property did not sell. Did you have some land for sale down here in Florida that, that didn't sell? Uh, I don't own this home. Hold on. I'll give it a call to that. Hold on. Oh, okay. Hello, this is Chris Igo with Remax. I'm giving you a call. I noticed you had some land down here for sale uh, that did not sell. Yeah, the, the, you about the, 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 the property with uh, Bearfield Beach? That's the one, yeah, in Arlington Park. Okay, it's, it's, not, it's nine lots, nine lots. It's a negative and a quarter. Commercial property. Right, I got that. Now, yeah. It looks like you you had the lots listed on the market for about a year, uh, or more than that, seven yeah. seven hundred yeah. days. Did you have any offers on the land while it was? Uh, well, yes, 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 yes. Listen, depends on what you want to do now. What you want to do over there for the property? Yeah. So my my question is, are you still interested in selling it? The buy or the sell? To sell it. Yes. Yeah. Yes, I'm, I'm ready. You ready? 
Well, here's the thing. If you knew, just so you know, I'm with Remax Direct. We've got six offices down here in South Florida. We've sold 15,000 homes, including land, uh, since 2008. We're averaging one home sale a day. Um, I wanted to ask right. you if you knew absolutely if you knew absolutely for certain that by doing business with me, two things would happen: one, the land would sell. Two, you would end up with significantly more money, bottom line, than you could get any other way. I know that's a big promise, but would you at least want to hear more about it? Be honest. Yeah, listen now. What do you want me to do? You want to give it to you, sell, or you want to buy? What do you want to do? I want to sell it for you. I want to find the one. You want to sell for me? Yeah, here's what I want I'm to do. I want to get you the mo the maximum amount po possible. I'm going to find what the, the, the what's the maximum amount? What's the number? That's a phenomenal question. Here's what I'll do. I want to run an analysis on the property and and, and email that to you so this way we're both fluent and speaking the same language as it relates to price. What you Listen to me. The property I have an appraisal worth a million dollars. Okay. So it's appraised at a million. If you feel you, know, you, feel you, can, you got somebody for a million dollars, want to buy, give me a call. Well, let me ask you. You had it listed at nine. Well, just real quick in closing. You, you had it You had it at 995. It's You're saying it's appraised yeah. at a million. And it was on the market right. for 700 days. How was the land marketed? Do you know? Uh -huh. You do? Yeah, yeah. No, well, what I want to do for you, I want you to hire me to go out there and find the one buyer on planet Earth that's willing to pay more. Do you know Tony Batista? I got to ask you a question. Are you friends with Tony Batista? Are you friends with Anthony Batista, Tony Batista? Are you two friends? Uh, I, th I thought he might you might be friends with him. That's why I'm asking. All right. Um, well, listen. Let me let me do this, okay? Because my method of selling land like this will expose your land to the buyers that you're looking for, okay? But and listen, I, if you want to buy property, give me an offer. That's all I can say. Okay. And what I'm going to do okay. is get you multiple offers on the property and have them compete to get the property. But in order for, for me to do that, I need you to hire me. Now, do you, you, you want to handle uh, 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 real estate? Yes. I can give it to you. Correct. No, I cannot do that. I cannot do that right now. I have an obligation with somebody else. No, actually, I'm, just so you know, the, the obligation has expired. It the, the listing agreement expired last night. That's why I'm calling Listen, you. You got somebody going to buy just to give me a call. Okay, I've got multiple people that are interested, but in order for yeah. me to in order for yeah. me to connect you with you, them, you we call, we got a list of. Give me call, me an offer, and we talk about any. All right. Well, let me ask you this: Bye. What's your best email address? <laughs> uh, there was no chance that guy was <laughs> was doing anything with me. Um. I thought you'd enjoy that, Murph. That was specifically for you. Um, all right, so. Mm -hmm. Your calling session is now complete. All right, so. Boom, that's the first pass of today's data. Go out there. What's your numbers? Are you committed to your numbers? What are your numbers? What do you? How many reach outs do you guys have to make today in order to get to where you want to be? At the end of the year, do you know those numbers? You better figure out those numbers. You better hit those reach out numbers. You better go out there and get some. All right, make it a great day.